um, I think one of the main things uh, about Trinity is you often have small car sizes and that's a great benefit to help uh, with one to one learning teachers. Uh, it's almost like nothing's too much uh, to ask for. I'm always willing to help if you have any questions or struggling a bit. For example, with uh, I'm doing three B techs instead of three A uh, so a lot of it's coursework. And uh, say if I'm just, I've got quite a few assignments all at once, they can always push back deadlines or um, or just help me where possible. So I think that's a great benefit as well. Okay, what's the best part of studying at Trinity? I'd probably say uh, you have a good balance of independence while being able to be supported where necessary. So it's, especially the older you get, especially going to sixth form, uh, it's all independent study. But then you also do have the option to have help from teachers and it's not, whereas if you went to somewhere like college, it's not you're not so isolated. Mm. I think also the fact that you have so many other options to school with their extra curricular activities, uh, there's always something else to do that you can use to improve your CV. Mm. Um, Absolutely. Which is something which is something quite important at school because obviously if you're competing with other people going for the same job as you, having anything extra is obviously a good thing. Yeah, do you feel like you've um, had your leadership skills uh, uh, advanced? Yeah, I mean the schools put in place uh, management positions for students, uh, so I think in year 7 to 9 they have uh, ambassadors, uh, in year 10 and 11 you have envoys and in 6th form you have prefects, so they're the management positions the school have for students who want to push themselves further and want to Fantastic. Can you tell me, since you're sporty, can you tell me a bit about sport at, at Trinity? Uh, so, I, my favourite sport is football, and uh, I've been able to captain the football team at uh, school for quite a few years now. Uh, obviously, we also have the usual sports such as like rugby and cricket. Um, as we're part of ISA, or we're, in, we're within ISA, we compete in big tournaments mm. between the other schools involved, so that might be swimming, uh, football. I think they do aquathons yep. in the lower years which is quite interesting and something different but there's always a lot of sport after uh, for example when I was uh, going through year probably year 9 to year 11 every year we'd go on a football trip to Nottingham to play in an ISA six side national tournament against the best teams in England and that's just an experience which not every kid is going to have uh, if you weren't in the situation. Yeah. How do you feel like doing things like sport help towards your sort of personal growth and school career? Uh, I think sport is very important for communication skills, uh, leadership skills. Uh, I think you help, it helps improve your team cohesion, so working together. Um, I think it's just obviously positive for your body and your mind. And I think as a school we are quite a sports school. And yeah. People do enjoy their sport. And we also have options for extra sport out of lessons, so you have sport clubs, which can be run by students. So, especially once you get into GCC and A level years, uh, you might often find yourself, if you're doing a big tech sport, or sport to be taking sport clubs for other year groups. And that's just another thing you can put on your CV. Fantastic. And last but not least, if you could describe Trinity in three of your own words. Whatever first comes into your mind. Um, I just say happy fellowship. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, everyone's happy. You also have options um, to speak to teachers whenever you want. If something's wrong, I'm sure if anything is wrong, be happy to talk yeah. to you as well. It's not just that you have to speak to teachers, you can speak to students as well. This is probably the hardest question. I haven't asked many students this, but if there was a case of bullying or you saw a case of bullying what would you do or what you're supposed to, what you're supposed to do about it what would happen well, in the school this is something that we often ask uh, i've been asked myself in different interviews at school so mm. uh, say if you're applying to be an airport and uh, i think even if it is your friend
friends who are doing it. Um, the school in school, but if it's wrong, it is wrong. And obviously, you'll be in a bad stand if you don't do anything about it. So I think that most students would know what to do and what the right thing would be to do. And I think that's obviously something which is important in the school. Um, I think bullying at Trinity's would be a very low amount. Um, because there was a scenario it would be dealt with quickly and quickly. Fantastic, thank you.